Isaiah prophesied, the people walking in darkness have seen a great light. On those living in the land of deep darkness, a light is dawn, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Of the greatness of his rule and peace, there will be no end. He will reign. See, in the midst of the darkness lay a broken world in need of a light, and that light is shown. By his own mouth he spoke, I am the way, the truth, and the life. He boldly declared, all authority in heaven and on earth belong to me. The world's hope had finally arrived. With mastery over the elements, he defied natural law, cured disease, raised the dead, gave sight to blind men, wisdom to the foolish. The winds obey him, the waves calm at his command, the sea itself like glass under his feet. The world cannot comprehend him, life itself could not contain him, and death, death could not keep him. He is seated and throned. He is the one who was, who is, and who is to come. Friends, if there is one truth I want you to take with you, one truth to fuel your every season of life, it is this one truth that we all must know. It's the truth that Peter knew as he spoke to thousands of Pentecost. It's the truth that Paul knew as he floated, shipwrecked in the sea. It's the truth that John knew on the island of Patmos. The truth that fueled 100 years of prayer by refugee. The truth that caused one small island to touch every continent on earth. That has caused hearts to come alive and miracles to abound. It has rallied students to gather together, crying out for revival. It has erupted in unending prayer and worship. It's the truth that in our time is causing young people to turn closets into prayer rooms and schools into mission fields. It's the truth that we know in one day, every tongue on earth will confess. The truth that will sustain you in all things. When the injustice of this broken world is at its most hideous. But when in spite of that world, we find